Hi, good morning, everyone. Today I have the pleasure of telling our audience more about the incredible painted birds you see on the Bioneer stage and more about the artist that made them. Danny McCoy Jr. is my dear friend and a beloved artist in the Native American arts community. An award-winning artist, Danny is Muscogee Creek and citizen band Potawatomi from Bristow, Oklahoma. We went to school together at the Institute of American Indian Arts in Santa Fe, where he received his BFA in 2D arts. Much to our honor, Danny donated his creativity, time, and awe-inspiring painting skills to Bioneers to bring you 24 brilliantly painted North American species of birds to the stage this year. A little bit about Danny. He was raised on a farm in Bristow, Oklahoma, deep in the heart of Indian country. He began in commercial arts as just a teenager, painting under the mentorship of commercial artist legend Chuck Osborne in Tulsa. Before the arts went digital, the specialized crew in Oklahoma hand-painted everything from TV backdrops, giant billboards, signs, and pinstriped vehicles. He thoroughly enjoyed being able to employ all those skills once again in the style and techniques in the work you see on stage today. For the Bioneer stage art, McCoy chose to, point, to paint 12 species of birds to remind us of our theme this year, uprise, migrate, pollinate. Of each species, there is one male and one female. Cardinals, bluebirds, tanagers, gamble quail, hummingbirds, white hawks, American blue jays, varied buntings, red-winged blackbirds, and robins, choosing mostly California species and just the two scissor tails that remind him of his youth in Oklahoma. He painted them in a style that reminds us of Canadian shaman artist Norval Morisot. I think these might be my very favorite stage art pieces ever, but then again, I might be biased. He's one of my favorite artists of all time. I'd like to take a moment to show you a short video of me visiting with Danny in Santa Fe talking shop about the art. What you see here before you is 24 different painted birds, uh, mainly from the California area with a couple of exceptions, which were from Oklahoma. Uh, the painting techniques are inspired from my beginnings in the sign business in Tulsa, Oklahoma, leading up to my influences of Rick Griffin, who was a San Francisco poster artist in the 60s and 70s and 80s. And then also, uh, last but not least, uh, Canadian Aboriginal artist Norval Morisot, um, who uh, did these great, bold, graphic techniques of all different types of animals, people, everything. My name is Danny McCoy, Jr. Um, I'm Muscogee Creek and Potawatomi from Bristow, Oklahoma. I'm super excited to be at Bioneers 2017. Each year, Bioneers works with Native American artists to produce unique and stylized Native American art that brings our stage to life. We also produce these pieces with the intention of our loving community being able to take them home as a piece of fine art and a memory of our shared time together. We host a silent auction through the weekend that takes place in the exhibit hall. So while you're being inspired by our revolutionary leaders and speakers, think about which one you love and go make a bid before it's too late. Several of us were already chatting last night about which ones we loved and we felt we needed to take home. When you bid on one of the birds, and if you win, your investment is split 50-50 between the Young Native Artists and Bioneers Indigenous Program. Two, two social investments you can feel great about. An investment in a Young Native Artist and an investment in Bioneers. Thank you. <laughs> 